Mr. Rahul is working in a bank and his family comprises of his wife Disha and his daughter Piyu, 7 years old. And as is commonly with all households, every morning begins with children tantrums. But today morning is unusual since Piyu is not well. Piyu is a very cute and beautiful child with an awesome smile which makes her the darling of all family occasions. Last night, the entire family had been to a birthday party. Piyu had lots of fun. Piyu keeps coughing in the night, making her restless. Piyu, I told you not to have too many chocolates and cold drinks in the party. But but you didn't listen to me. Disha had a bad night as Piyu was coughing till early morning. Next morning, Disha takes Piyu to a pediatrician, Dr. Khosla. Hello Piyu, how are you? Doctor, Piyu is continuously coughing since last night. We had been to a party yesterday evening, wherein she had chocolates and cold drinks. No worries, let me examine her. Did Piyu had a fever last night? No. Since how many days is Piyu coughing at night? Yeah, um, she had woke up due to coughing at night, um, a week back as well. Okay, does she cough during the daytime as well? Yes, but nights and early mornings are worse. Does Piyu find it difficult to breathe after running or playing sports? Yes, sometimes she finds difficulty in breathing, but her cough is most bothersome. So much so that it interferes with her activities like playing and sleeping. She also has to miss school sometimes. Since how many years does Piyu have breathing problems? Um, uh, well... Uh... Does anybody in your family have problems in breathing? No, but Dr. Piyu's grandpapa keeps on sneezing in the morning and has nose blockage due to sinus. But it happens with him only in the morning. Rest of the day he is fit and fine. Okay. Well, Disha, you really helped me in understanding what Piyu would be suffering from. Since Piyu doesn't have fever, she finds it difficult to breathe after running and has family history too. I think it's asthma. Piyu has her airways blocked due to mucus secretion and inflammation, that is swelling of the lining of the airways, and the airway smooth muscles which constricts, causing narrowing of the airways, due to which she coughs and has difficulty in breathing. Dr. Khosla, what causes blockage of airways? There are multiple reasons for this, and some children are more likely to get this because they have a family history of allergies. Triggers like outdoor allergens and irritants, such as pollens from grass and trees, pet dander, dust mites, tobacco smoke, chemical fumes, strong odors like perfumes as well as changes in weather. Moreover, the viral infection can cause children to wheeze and cough. Did cold drinks and chocolates cause airway blockage? No. Cold drinks and chocolates does not lead to blockage of airways until and unless Piyu is allergic to it. Disha, does Piyu's father smoke? No, but sometimes that too outside the home, not at home, not at all. Disha, tobacco smoke is a major trigger since the tobacco irritant remains in the mouth for a long period of time. So you need to keep your home clean and free from dust and avoid coming in contact with tobacco smoke and fumes. Doctor, is there any test to confirm why Piyu is suffering from blockage of airways? Diagnosis can be confirmed by a test called spirometry. Tests like an x-ray or a blood test only rule out other diseases. But doctors can diagnose and suspect asthma on history and examination as well. Doctor, will Piyu keep on coughing till her test reports comes? No. For the time being, I am prescribing her bronchodilator to give her immediate relief. Disha, Piyu is suffering from asthma. Oh no! But doctor, I have heard that breastfeeding doesn't cause asthma. I have breastfed Piyu for almost two years. Well, it helps in reducing the risk of asthma onset in a child. Does Piyu need to pop a tablet day and night? 
Who will help her taking tablet at school? Nothing to worry. We have medication which will control her symptoms and she will have no difficulty in breathing without taking a tablet. Without taking a tablet? Yes, without a tablet. This is an inhaler to be taken twice a day, anytime, anywhere. Controller inhalers prevents asthma symptoms and reduce the risk of an asthma attack by decreasing the inflammation that is swelling and making airways less sensitive to trigger factors. This controller should be taken every day, even when symptoms are not present. Doctor, are inhalers safe? And will PU become an addicted to inhalers? Inhalers are very safe. Through inhalers, the drug directly reaches to the airways, so very less quantity is required, leading to low side effects. PU will not become addicted to it, since it will just help her to control her asthma. Disha, I have also prescribed an inhaler to be taken only when her symptoms aggravate or PU gets an asthma attack. Reliever medication works quickly by relaxing tight muscles to open the airway, making it easier to breathe. And so PU should carry this with her wherever she goes. Disha, ensure that PU takes her inhaler through spacers. What are these spacers now? Spacers make it easy to deliver inhaled medicines to children. With this, a child can inhale a complete dose of medicine while breathing in and out normally through the mouth. It helps the child to obtain full benefits of the medicine. Step 1. Sit or stand upright. Remove the mouthpiece cap and shake the inhaler well. Insert the inhaler into the opposite end. Hold it upright with your thumb. Place either one or two fingers on the top of the canister. Step 2. Breathe out fully through your mouth. Step 3. Place the mouthpiece of the spacer in your mouth between your teeth and close your lips around it. Do not bite. Step 4. Start breathing in slowly through your mouth. Press down the canister firmly and fully to release one spray while continuing to breathe in slowly and deeply. You will see the dose released in the spacer. Step 5. Let the child breathe normally for 30 seconds as long as it is comfortable. Step 6. If another puff is required, wait for a minute. Shake the inhaler well and repeat the steps from 2 to 5. Step 7. After use, replace the mouthpiece cap firmly and snap it into its position. Rinse your mouth with water. It is so simple. I think Pew would be able to do it on her own. <laughs> yes, it's very simple. And moreover, the advantage is that it can be taken anytime, anywhere. But please, supervise her medications. Now, Pew can take her medicine, even at night, whenever there is an emergency. Thank you so much, Dr. Khosla. Come, Pew. Let's go. Pew is taking her medicine through the inhaler with the help of the spacer, without her mother's assistance. And she has no coughing or breathing problems. <laughs> Pew is happily jumping and playing. She doesn't miss her school. PU now controls her asthma anytime, anywhere.